Ahoy! Captain Nick here. Days number five and six of quarantine here in the brewery. The weather has been lovely of late. Uh, morale has been slightly strained as we've faced with a lot of challenges of trying to run a small business during the lockdown, of course. However, today I've got quite an exciting task I would like you guys to try at home. Disclaimer, please do not burn down your house and be very careful and follow my instructions carefully. Let's go take a look. So for this task, we're going to be building matchstick rockets. What you're going to be needing is a box of matches, a paper clip, and some tin foil and a lighter. So to start, what you're going to do is take two matches out of the matchbox, just like that. And you're going to cut the heads off the matches. Right, with the tips cut off the matchsticks, we're going to take one of those and put it aside and we're going to be using these two and that. Next, we're going to take a piece of tin foil, roughly the size of a matchbox. Now we're going to place the two matchstick heads next to each other inside the tin foil and the matchstick like that. Now what we're going to do is roll it up, turn the pointy bit into like a rocket head and then we're going to pull this one out to create a chamber. So here we are rolling it up. Now we are going to turn the front into a pointy bit, like a rocket. Next we're going to take our paper clip and we're going to turn it into a launch pad. So I've bent this paper clip into a launch pad structure. We're going to take it to the end of the table and we're going to take our rocket and we're going to pop it on top just like that. We want to make sure it can still flow freely up and down and we're going to give it a light squeeze onto the platform. Next we're going to take our lighter. If you have a longer lighter that's even better, it's safer. But for now this is all we have and we're going to put a flame directly underneath and hold it until it shoots. And that's how you make a matchstick rocket. Give it a try but please please be safe and don't get burnt.